Hello, I'm Tiffany and welcome to The Raw Report. A Republican state legislative candidate in Virginia posed an interesting question on Twitter recently. Scott Pio, who is challenging Democrat David Reed in Virginia's Loudoun County's District 32, wrote, I'm curious, do you think the sea level would lower if we just took all the boats out of the water? Just a thought, not a statement. Pio subsequently deleted his tweet, but not before it was picked up by the Democratic group Blue Virginia. Pio later wrote in response to Blue Virginia's post, When you take things out of bath water, the bath water decreases, does it not? Got a lot of hate from your group for asking a question about taking things out of the water. Curious when you stopped believing in pure physics. I guess you don't believe in science experiments. In its post, Blue Virginia pointed to some of Pio's other views, including his opposition to abortion in all cases, and his belief that there should be no restrictions on guns. Blue Virginia wrote, The scary thing is, this guy's not an outlier for today's Republican Party, the party of Donald Trump, Marjorie Taylor Greene, Lauren Boebert, Bob Good, etc. Which means, of course, that we'd better not let these people take power, here in Virginia or nationally, unless or until their entire party fundamentally changes back to sanity and actual conservative principles, not extremist lunacy. According to a tweet from last November, Pio is the organizer of the Trump International Rapid Response Team, which mobilizes in support of the former president when he golfs in Virginia. Randall Monroe, an engineer who authors the award-winning webcomic XKCD, recently calculated an estimated answer to Pio's question about the impact of removing all boats from the water. Monroe concluded that the impact on sea levels would be about six microns, slightly more than the diameter, of a strand of spider silk. Quote, but you don't have to worry about that six micron level sea drop, Monroe wrote. The oceans are currently rising at about 3.3 millimeters per year due to global warming through both glacial melting and thermal expansion of seawater. At that rate, if you removed every ship from the ocean, the water would be back up to its original average level in just 16 hours. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to visit rawstory.com. And if you'd like to see more of the Raw Report, please like and subscribe and join others who like their news raw too.